guys, so today I'm going to be doing another cooking video. Um, I never used in try to do them, but I am today. I hope guys like these cooking videos. Um, but I seem to feel like a lot of people on YouTube, when I watch them cook or make cakes or anything, you shop for packets. I don't know if it's just me, but I don't think that's very good because cake take it to whip up a basic sponge mixture it takes 10 minutes or under 10 minutes for your mum it takes my mum about five minutes to whip up a basic cake mixture and it's really simple you don't need many ingredients and it's really easy to remember you literally this is just the recipe reads every time you don't need a book we just use this recipe because it's so simple so i'm going to show you how to make cakes today and because it is valentine's day i am doing heart shape because it's Valentine's Day and I thought I'd make these a little bit Valentine's Day easy. Well, it's not today, but it's almost Valentine's Day. I'm showing you what you need. Tilt your camera down. So, you're going to need um, four ounces of caster sugar. Now, you can change this around depending on how much you want to make. Um, and I'm working in ounces just because it's easier to remember the recipe for cake. So, I just want to mention that quickly. Um, I'm going to leave a... If I can find a link of um, ounces and grams, I'll leave those in the um, down bar. So, yeah, you're going to need four ounces of caster sugar or eight or six or whatever you like. I would make it an even number. So, yeah. Um, um, some vanilla essence. This is like the magic ingredient. Um, Another four ounces of self-raising flour, so that's that in here. Um, again, you can change it up, but you need the same amount of self-raising flour and sugar, caster sugar. Um, you're going to need two eggs, so you need half the number of eggs of ounces of other ingredients that you need. Again, four ounces of butter or margarine. Uh, I'm using store. So it's really simple. If you work in ounces, all you have to do is use exactly the same number of ounces of everything and then half the amount of extra ounces. Um, and then a something to put them in. So whether this is cupcake cases or um, silicone heart thing. And you will also need a bowl to mix the ingredients and a whisk. So let's just get cooking.
perfectly. Right, this one for example. But they're really, really yummy. Hmm. Don't forget you can always add chocolate chips or like even stewed apple or um, chocolate or strawberries. I don't know how well strawberries would work, but um, you could try. Uh, or toffee. You know, whatever you like to these. And uh, banana. See how they turn out. But these is a basic sponge cake mixture, and it's really, really yummy. So I'm going to share these with all my friends and family. You should make them too. So. Hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you all next time. Bye.